Okay, here we are. Here we are. Whew. I'm ready. I feel very uncomfortable watching this. Let's go, Zari. Let's all go. Because we're family. I guess it's true. Ha! Step away, sir. Is Sarah eating this crap? Oh, stop it, John. Just... Oh, oh. Mm. I'm like sweating. Oh, oh. What? Mm. Oh. 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 The look. Yes. 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 Oh, no, 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 no. This is so bad. Stop this. Oh. Okay, this is the shit that we want. I can smell the fight coming. It is coming our way. I am ready. And let's be real that Guys, I'm nervous. <laughs> I hi. How's it going? <laughs> Are you guys nervous? I well you probably have seen the episode, hopefully, already. Um I don't think I've been this nervous. For a Legends episode in a long time. <laughs> and okay, so the episode we're watching is um, season 6, episode 13, called Silence of the Sonograms. So I'm guessing has something to do with mixed babies. They're probably gonna be born in this episode, maybe? I don't know. Or something's gonna happen with them. And Bishop, I. I cannot believe the way that they ended last episode. It was so like it was so dramatic and so great and I loved it and it was a great cliffhanger and a great parallel to episode 3 I think when um when we heard Bishop playing Space Girl and Sarah meeting Bishop for the first time like walking through the place and then finding him and that's what happened at the end of last episode and I okay now we're now we're getting to see what that will be like what is happening what is he doing there they're going to like interrogate him which that is the reason why me and probably some other people are really nervous because he's just going to get into their heads Especially Ava, I can I can feel it. It's happening because um, We know that there's gonna be like a 10 page Scene between the two of them when she's interrogating him. I'm hoping I'm hoping that we are finally getting Some answers about Ava's past answers about Bishop like what is he doing and what does he want and how is he back? I hope that we're getting some kind of like an actual conversation between Ava and Sarah about I don't know all of this. I feel like maybe it's all happened off camera and that's fine. But um <laughs> but I would love to see that too. Cuz now I bet Bishop is probably going to tell Ava that Sarah was on the planet full of Ava clones and that I don't know, like, does Ava know that Bishop is the one that created the Avas? I don't know. We don't know. But I have a feeling we're gonna find out a lot in this episode, so... <laughs> yeah, I... <laughs> last week, okay, last week we had the murder mystery episode and it was awesome. It was so great. I really, really enjoyed it. It was so well made and the idea was super cool. It's definitely one of those episodes that I will remember that like stands out, I think. Um, yeah, that's what happened last week. I'm sorry, I can't even think about anything else. I just really, really want to watch this episode. I'm like... Okay, are we ready? I don't know if I'm ready because I can't take this any longer. Uh, okay, alright guys, let's go. Okay. Look at her face. She's like ready to murder someone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is me listening to the song now that the album is out. I love that he's singing it. I love Bishop. 
in case you haven't seen my reactions earlier when we had him, I love him. I hate him, but I love him. He is great. And he is singing Space Girl. Space Girl. What are you doing here? How are you even alive? What a yes. fantastically boring question. A better question would be why. Why shouldn't I just slit your throat and watch you bleed out on my carpet? <laughs> oh! Because then you wouldn't have any more of your questions answered. Until you print yourself This is true. Again. Alas, you're looking at the last gen me. My data was corrupted when a certain... You kidnapped me. You manipulated me in every yes. possible way. Yes. True. True. It is true. But I also saved you. I'm I'm not breathing right now. <sighs> I feel like the entire episode is going to be this intense and I'm like I need to I don't know. Relax. <laughs> no. No. I've changed. Changed. <laughs> sure. And why should I believe Sir. You? Let me prove it to you. Come on. You say Sir Lance? No. Is there room for one more mixed up outcast on this zany little ship of yours? Absolutely not, sir. Not even like considering it, not even a little bit. <laughs> and she is not either. Actually, I think we have a room that would suit you perfectly. The okay. Great. That's Bishop. Not at all what I was expecting. For a psychotic super villain, the guy's got a great look. Yeah, they always do. So, well, shall we start with the introduction? I mean, it's a great suit. <laughs> with the leopard print and everything, it's great. You are, of course, Ava. Oh, what you do not Ava? talk to her. I mean, he's going to talk to her this entire episode, but I'm, I'm already like, I'm like sweating. No. Okay. What is he saying? You are, of course... Ava. Not just any Ava. The Ava. Congratulations, yes. by the way. Your engagement ring? So, do you two get... Mm. I feel like as much as he's gonna push their buttons, he's gonna push ours. <laughs> I am not okay. I am not okay. What? Ring? So, do you two kids have a date yet? Or... Alright, that is enough. Don't listen. To him don't even talk to him he's just trying to get into our heads so that he can do whatever it is he came here to do yes. Where is she? you my colleague <laughs> he was just on the floor this entire time i i i forgot that he has hair now it's quite unfortunate for him <laughs> honestly <laughs> i'm the fact that Dom is leaving the show, I'm like, I I do kind of understand. He's gone through some pretty nasty things in this last season. I feel kind of bad for him. Very strong thoughts about you. Let's go. Everybody out. Let's go. This Nine. way. Try to escape. Shoot him in the face. You got it, Capitan. <laughs> yes. Okay, leaving Spooner in charge. You can shoot off his face. Oh, I love it. I'm. Oh. You got it, Capitana. Capitana. Why would I want to escape when I feel like I am finally home? No. No. Bishop is. We destroyed his compound before he could finish uploading himself. You know what, guys? Oh, true! I don't know. <laughs> I just wanted to acknowledge that. That's true. 6% of him was still missing. Okay. I feel like we're gonna get so many answers today. I hope. I hope. A true psychopath wouldn't want to just murder the woman who destroyed his life work. He'd really want to take some time torturing her, you know? Thanks, babe. That's very reassuring. But if Bishop wants to play chess, he has chosen the wrong opponent. Uh, no. No, no, no. Absolutely not. Please, 
Come on, babe. I've always wanted to get inside the mind of an evil genius. Who oh my gosh, Ava is like you this is the moment you choose to like geek out. But I'm not sure this is a good idea. I mean, I know it's not a good idea. But she looks so excited. Look at her. She's like, please let me go. Wrong. Absolutely not. Please. Come on, babe. I've always wanted to get inside the mind of an evil genius. Who technically <gasps> speaking created you? <gasps> Both of you, actually. Not helping, Nate. Look, babe. I'll just go in there and try to find a way to connect with him. Okay. All right. All right. Just don't let him get near it, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, that was, um, I mean, Sarah gave in pretty easily. She should know at this point that he's gonna, like, destroy her. He's gonna, like, I don't know, like, mess up with her head. And Sarah was just like, you sure? Okay. Have fun. <laughs> I mean, she had to, because otherwise we wouldn't have this great episode coming up. Okay. Oh, that's right, and John and- oh, well, there she is. Okay, she like hit him with the whatever thingy, and the scar is there, even though it was the- well, you saw it, whatever. Anyways, this is hopefully what will make- <laughs> what's her face? Sorry. Realize what is going on and actually like come to her senses because John is not doing great and he's doing this to himself And now Zari kind of knows I guess <sighs> But we also heard last episode that she loves him and that already broke my heart just hearing that because we know that it's not gonna end well Okay, well Look at her Yeah, she ain't happy oh, coming back to me now. <laughs> The look! I made a dog's dinner out of that pile again, didn't I? I take it the beast got me. No, John, that was me. I stabbed the beast in the back and somehow you woke up with a scar. Ooh, look, I yes. Explain. Oh, can you? How you lied to me yet again. Lying was part of God's game. I didn't make up the rules, love. Don't call me love. And don't pretend like this was all a game. You know, my brother was right about you. You're different, John. Yeah, I'm different. I mean, how many people do you know have drunk from the fountain of bloody Imperium? But oh, God. stop it, John! I just oh. a little bit of time to damn it, Johnny. Yeah. Yeah. John signed me. I'm done. I'm, oh, glad he's feeling like his old self. No, he's he's trying to blame his behavior on the fountain, but I don't buy it. Can't you? Even Zari looks tiny next to Astra. I love it. Some kind of truth serum or whatever. Yeah, it's called Scotch. Hey, I'm serious. You would still be stuck in that game if it weren't for me. That is a great idea. She can help us. Come on. I guess my life could use a little more drama. <laughs> I guess. Let's go. She's like, I guess I want to be involved in this. I want to know what's going on. What's going to happen? Same. Let's go. I was hoping we'd have a chance to... Okay, here we are. Here we are. <sighs> I'm ready. <laughs> Get to know each other, just you and me. But you already know me. You had a planet full of me's, didn't you? Don't sell yourself so short. She knows that? What? So they've talked about it. Off camera, that's great. We didn't get to see that. That's fantastic, that's fine. So Ava knows, and what, what happened to them? You had a planet full of me's, didn't you? Sarah could have had her pick of my Avas if she turned over the heavens to get back to you. So what makes you so special? Yes, she did. Tell us, Ava, what makes you so special. Please. She turned so over what the makes heavens. You so special? Please. Don't go. We've hardly broken the ice. Mmm, bad it, girl. You see that? Ha! Making Bishop think that she's the vulnerable one. Mm. Okay. You know what? You oh, nice. You oh, nice. The parallels again with them playing chess and the okay, this is great. This is great. <sighs> so Ava is playing a game with him. So, okay, I'm not gonna say anything. Okay, at least we know that she's like, she knows what she's doing. You know what? You can play nice all you want, but it still doesn't excuse the fact that you kidnapped the woman that I love. But the fact that I did so in order to save all of humanity... It doesn't. ...changes nothing. You're right. I was an arrogant, egomaniacal... 
Mimi. So what? Yeah. Hmm? You and Sarah are the closest thing I have left to family. <laughs> what? Sir, please. I mean... I guess it's true. I don't know. She, no, she's not gonna give in that easy. Okay. Knowing this show, he did not come here now to be friends with them. No, no. What? You're a clone, I'm a clone, and it's not like I have any real family, so... Ava! I guess in some perverse way, we are like family. Um... Uh, uh, no. <laughs> no, no. We're like five minutes in. I'm hoping she's still like playing his game, because this is not looking good otherwise. Oh, well, there we go. <laughs> okay, let's... Okay. And some ambitious not gonna let himself be manipulated that easily. Uh, that's Can true. I, you were always my favorite Ava. Not you personally, of course. Stop Your it. Your model. No. You mean bossy Ava? Ugh, a moniker our marketing department came up with. I wanted to call <laughs> boss Ava. Only people were afraid of a clone that would tell them... Boss the Ava. Okay, let's go. I mean... I mean... I wanted to call you. Well, you have exceeded my wildest dreams. You're getting married. Didn't see that one coming. Why not? I lowered the oxytocin levels in all the clones. The so-called love hormone. I don't want you falling in love. It hurts productivity. <sighs> what? Maybe that's why I'm having such a hard time planning this damn wedding. Sarah even knew I was talking to you. Oh, come on! That'll be our little secret. She is playing him. She is playing him. Good job, Ava. Oh, I don't... Okay, this is great. How do I know that you're not just doing this to get me to let my guard down? I am doing this so that you let your guard down. Yeah. <laughs> I want to get to know you, right. Ava. Right, because we're family. <laughs> I have to go. It's either that or... His brain. E no, yeah, no, we don't want that. <laughs> Ew, no, 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 no. We're pouring it in through the ear. <laughs> That's so gross. This is just the opening move of our little chess match. Is Sarah eating this crap? It's not that bad. Oh. What? I have alien taste buds, what can I say? Are you sure it's okay we leave Spinner in there alone with Bishop? That is disgusting Sarah Lance I have alien taste buds please there's no way he's getting in her head yeah. no he's not yes she's so cool she's literally Spooner is like so cool what can I say that's Bishop huh that turtleneck is doing him no favors <laughs> That was their first interaction, right? That is so funny because he is Tala's real life husband, right? Um, that is so funny. The turtleneck is not doing him any favors. I mean, I could argue with that. He looks great, I think. Yes. Uh, I was with them and the kid Fernando in the cave. The fascists were coming, and Spence, you okay? The, the fascists were coming, and it's like something's missing, like a blank spot in my memory. Like something's been erased. Because he erased her memory at the end of that episode. Because he's John and he's stupid. You think John put a spell on me? Well, you I'm think? Uh, just not until we find out what he wanted you to forget. Which means <laughs> I'm gonna have to. Then you can do it. I feel like Spooner is the assassin in this moment. Like whenever they need someone to like take care of business, they're like, Spoons, uh, this is on you. What are you guys... Ugh, anyway, I need a moment, Bishop. He is all yours. Just in case somebody gets out of line. Thanks. Go this way. Round two. Round two. Okay. I don't know if I... Okay. This is my theory. The first one was fine. Ava was 
in charge of the moment. She knew what was happening. She was playing him. I don't know how many rounds we're gonna have, but I'm sure he's gonna cry. Cause then we saw the freaking clip in the trailer where she's like crying in the hallway. And if she's crying in the hallway, that means that she's not doing an act for him. You know, she's not like trying to pretend that she's not okay. She's actually not okay. So she, uh, you know, he's gonna get to her and I'm not okay with that. So? What's wrong with John? Oh, I don't know. Just, your friends seem concerned about him. That maybe he drank something he shouldn't have. He could hear that? Of course, I, I'm not, <laughs> I'm like, why am I even surprised? John's fine. <laughs> yeah, John's great. Look at him. Why do you do it to yourself? See, I'm so done with this storyline, but it's fine. Oh, someone's <laughs> gonna pick up the money. No, 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 stop! <gasps> I am you. Not okay. This is not okay. It's a nice wide shot. That was great. What? These two just sitting here playing chess. It seems like him and Sarah and Ava are kind of like... Like, he's there for both of them. He's kind of like both of their person, you know? And I love it. But like I said last episode, I would love to see him, like, on his own, having his own storyline. But it is great to see him, like, support them. I really love it. Fighting. I don't bet against my girl. No, you don't. The wedding binder is out. Okay. The shit is getting real. Spy with it's thorough. Yes, I've heard that. <laughs> Sarah put me in charge because usually I'm the decisive one and I can't seem to choose a single thing. Okay. Let's start simple. I've never actually been to a wedding. Hmm? Yeah, I was sort of known as the... Uh, Ava! Does Ray and Nora's wedding not count? <laughs> was she like the maid of honor? That's fine. <laughs> I mean, I guess it wasn't planned, but she's never been to a wedding. That's pretty sad. It's wedding you've ever. I was sort of known as the uh, party pooper at the time bureau, so. Hey. Look. Oh, honey. <laughs> that's probably true, but um, that's so sad. So yeah, cause like her life started when she was recruited for the bureau. So the only like friends or people or family that she's had are like her fake parents and everyone from the bureau. And she was the boss and not very fun, I guess. <laughs> so that's true. Like whose wedding would she have been to, for example? <sighs> that's so sad. Stopping the boss. Speed round. What's your favorite flower? Uh, is cactus a flower? Color. <laughs> <laughs> what? Is cactus a flower? Please, Ava Sharp. No, it's, well, no. Not in this context when you're talking about weddings. Color. Gray. Appetizer. See, this is the thing about appetizers. I don't understand why people have to eat before they eat. Okay, so the ceremony will be unconventional. Her favorite color is gray. We are learning so much in this episode. I'm weird. Why the hell did you have to make me so weird? Look, first off. Stop. Oh, and I think at this point, it's getting harder to tell if she is acting or if she is not like now being for real. You know, like, is he getting into her head now or is she still in charge of this moment? I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna take that back. Vegan cakes are disgusting. <laughs> and don't forget, I'm a clone too. A clone of a clone. Step away, clone sir. No, no. How exactly is... This you, different from the you Sarah knew. Hmm, good question. It is a good question. Come on, you psycho son of a bitch. Tell her <laughs> There was something missing from the me that Sarah met on Pliny X-19. Took me a long time to find it. Yes. You want to know what it was? Please, please do tell us, sir. Crap. 
<laughs> really, Bishop? Sure. You don't want to bite my tongue out? You're such a baby. <laughs> Tortured mind. These two, Spooner and Esther, I am I love the chemistry and the banter that they have. Secrets hidden. Great. Show me that which is forbidden. And Aster doing magic, I am here for it. Look at her. He took a sip of something. Look, I don't yes. know what it was, but when he drank it, that's when he killed the soldiers who were attacking us. The freaking blood nail polish thing from the vampire, the French vampire lady. Where the hell are you going? Oh, I'm just gonna break up with my lying dumpster fire of a boyfriend. A juiced up one. <laughs> Let's go, sorry. Let's all go. We want to come and just watch. <laughs> Poor John, I'm sorry, but let's go. You going? First, we need to figure out exactly what John's been dosing himself with. True. Your betrothed she needs to like keep playing him. Poor Zari, I seriously feel so bad for her. This is gonna crack her. Taste in music and in love. It seriously look like he looks like he's getting to her. It like her reactions now seem like they're actually Ava's reactions and not just like her playing this game with him. And that is not good at all. I like it. So I'm not sure how you how do you dance to it? Let me show you. No. It'll be absolutely anywhere. not. Absolutely no dancing with Mr. Bishop, please. Uh, father daughter dance? Um. <laughs> Did he just say father daughter dance? I don't know. I feel like I'm dreaming. Like, I can't believe that this is actually happening. This feels like what like everyone's been talking about clowning over <laughs> being like yeah maybe this will happen maybe they will you know do a father daughter dance maybe he will walk her down the aisle blah 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 this is actually happening guys this is real and i'm not okay it'll be our father daughter dance absolutely not i'm not sure that's a good idea no it's not no you it is not Sarah watching he knew of course he knew That can't be good. Eva is just me. Excuse me, what? It may look like I'm chill, but my heart is literally like this right now. Because I am not okay with this. This is like creepy, you know? This is like freaking me out in a whole another level. She just turned off the freaking camera. I don't think that that is still part of her game, honestly. That can't be good. Yeah. Eva is just making Bishop think that she is playing into his hand. Like I am doing to you. I would like to think so, but honestly, I'm not sure anymore. Oh my god, it's happening. <laughs> this is- this is- so wrong in so many ways. I feel very uncomfortable watching this. <laughs> Help. It's not going back on. Maybe that's for the best. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Song. Mm. Sarah's gonna love it. Did you design me to feel that way? But <gasps> Why should your feelings be any less real than Don't touch else's? her. I'm proud of you, Ava. I only wish we could have a dance of our own on your special day. No, I don't. No. She is crying. Stop this. Stop this. No, no. Okay, no. Okay, no, no. Okay, when, 
when I say, okay, I don't even know, I'm, I'm like, oh, that, that was horrible and amazing, both. We need to look at that again. When I use the words, Jess McCallan is a great actor, this is what I mean. This is what I'm gonna use from now on. Everything she did in this scene, like you can see that she's not in control of the moment anymore. She's not contr in control of like anything and you can see it from her. Oh, cause he's like, he's probably saying all the things that she always wanted and needed to hear. And she never did. And now she's hearing it from him. The guy who literally created her and who is a horrible person and like just a crazy man. This is so bad, but look at Miss McCallan here. She is freaking, she is so freaking good. She is, I, okay, okay. Your feelings like look at her reaction else. here. I only wish we could have a dance of our own on your special day. I can't. Look at her. This is a great shot to moving out. That's it. That's, that's, that's all. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. She's fantastic. Jess McCallum. Ah! This is what I think of acting, which I've actually told her to, that I think great acting is when you don't even feel like someone is acting. You know, you're watching someone act and you don't think that they're acting at all because what they do just seems so real that you kind of don't, you don't even feel like you can look, you know, you kind of want to look away because it just looks so personal and like a real and raw and that is what that scene, for example, did and does and will do many times, to me at least. You know when you're watching someone and you're like, like even now I felt like, you know, like you can't even look. And that's what she does. And that's what she always does with these like sad and emotional things. Ah. <sighs> Like I said, I'm like, I've told it, like, I've told that to her and I really hope that she can take it in because this is freaking amazing. She is so great. Okay, and then she's like pulled herself together and fine. Cause see, this is what I kind of wanted was for her to be like crying on the floor and then Sarah coming in trying to make her feel better. But she comes and she's just like sitting there like, meh, nah, that's fine. That you trust him? I mean, what a performance. That was a performance, right? Yeah, yeah. No, no, it was not. It was not. I need to go back after. <laughs> And you can, you can tell me what you think, like at what point, I need to go back and watch this. Like what is the point where it switches from Ava acting to her just like going with whatever Bishop is saying. I know it's part of his actor, whatever, but doesn't mean it isn't true, right? Yeah, um, this is dangerous. I don't like this because this, all of this just tells me that he got to her. If she trusts him, I don't trust her. You know what I mean? It's like, no, I don't like it. I think you, he is gonna use you guys to get to me, which is smart. Or maybe this isn't about you. Maybe the guy's just lonely. Ava Sharp, stop what you're doing. To get to me, what? which is smart. Or maybe this isn't about you. Maybe the guy's just lonely, you know? Not everybody has a family that they can call their own. <laughs> I mean, I'm not okay with her like taking his side and fighting with Sarah. That's not how this is supposed to go. Her and Sarah are supposed to be on the same side fighting against him. I understand where she's coming from though. 
she is literally a clone. I mean, now they're both clones, lol. But she doesn't have it. You know, like, it makes sense why Bishop would get to her. Because she has this background. Anyways. John. And oh, Zari. Yeah. Okay. So she just... She's gonna just pretend that everything is fine and she's just checking up on him. Because they need to find out what she, like what the drink is or like what the potion is that he's drinking. So now she's just using him, I guess. I don't know. Or maybe she's just not ready to accept the fact that she needs to like let him go. I love you. I just, I hate to piss you off, you know? You look tired. He just said it. Did he just wait? Did I hear that correctly? I love you. I just I hate to piss you off, you know. He just told her that he loves her. And we know that she loves him. This just keeps getting worse and harder and more painful. But I do kind of love it because if we want the drama. I feel bad that we need to watch John go, but at the same time, I'm ready. <laughs> but I think the way that he is leaving is, it's just sad. And it makes me sad for him and for Zari. It kind of feels like no one else is re really affected by it. Like Gary, for example, you would think that he's gonna like freak out, but he's probably, I don't know, busy being an alien and stuff. <laughs> um. We are already halfway through the episode. I'm like... This is one of the most stressful episodes ever of this show. My heart rate has been like way too high this entire time. But we're gonna take a break now. And we will continue in part two. I don't even know what to say except I'll see you guys there.